Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Wade, and today I'm about to give you guys an update on what happened on the market this week, okay? And before we get right into it, guys, if you like this type of content, like and subscribe to the channel, and I will go over my challenge. Um, stay tuned, guys, and we're going to get right into it here. So the first thing we're going to be talking about is the percentage of return for each index fund that I'm doing the 2022 challenge with. And we're going to start with the S&P 500, which is SPY. And guys, let's take a look for the week. We are down 2%, 2.18%. And what I've been doing is I've been adding 50 bucks a week. Usually on Monday, I'll buy. So this one, tomorrow, I'll buy some as well. Okay, so let's take a look at the three-time leverage for this, which is the SPXL. And to see how it performed. Now we take a look at this one. Take a look at the weekly. Ooh, we down 6.41%. That's okay because tomorrow I'll be doing some more buying. Okay, guys, I'm averaging 50 bucks a week and I'm spreading it across these ETF. Hope you watched my last video. If not, I'll put a link down below if you guys want to go watch it to kind of see what challenge that I'm doing for the year. Okay, so I'm dollar cost averaging for the whole year. So we're down 6% for the week, which is a, a dramatic number, but this is a three-time leverage. If the S&P 500 goes down 2%, this will go down 6 as I explained in my last video. So, and then let's take a look at the QQQ, which is a NASDAQ 100 ETF. And let's look at the weekly here. Ouch, this one is down 4.8%. This is a pretty big number, guys, considering markets usually average 8, 10 to 12% a year. This one is down 4.8% in a week, which is a dramatic dump. And the reason why, why this is happening is uh, there's a big rotation going out of tech because feds are expecting to raise rates pretty soon, like in a few months. So we just just know that if rates, rates goes up, it affects tech stocks because the funding that's going in the market, the liquidity will not be there anymore. So. And then let's take a look at the TQQ, which is a three time leverage of the NASDAQ 100. And as we can see here, this is down 14%. That is uh, that is pretty dramatic. So, um, but I'm not feared by this. Tomorrow I'm gonna be adding more. So I'm gonna be adding on the dip. So this is the opportunity for me to load up going on for the rest of the year. It will be a pretty choppy year. So you just got to stay locked in and focus. Okay, guys. And then let's take a look at the DIA, which is the Dow Jones Industrial. This one did fairly better than the other ones. They didn't go down as much. 0.46%. Um, we're also going to be buying some of that tomorrow. And then let's take a look at the three-time leverage for the Dow Jones 100. And this one is down about... 1.4%. So that's actually really good. We'll be buying this tomorrow because out of the, the these ETF, this one is down the least amount, which is it shows that stability for that particular um, index. So let's go to the SPYG, which is the S&P 500 growth companies. So this one for the week, we are down 4.86%. So this is actually down a big number as well, but I am okay with this. I'll be adding some more tomorrow to these ETF. Uh, the market is overreacting and a little bit skittish and scary as far as rates going higher. So we're seeing a big rotation going on, guys. But if we stay locked in and we add every week, we don't care what the price is doing as long as in the future we end up higher, which is what I'm predicting that we will be ending up higher because this pretty much buying the u.s economy so we will see how things play out and i'm adding every week so it seems to me that i'm getting a discount who doesn't like a sale so i like sales if apple have a sale tomorrow i'll go buy a new iphone or something this that's how you have to look at this so guys thank you for tuning in this is the quick update of the market and what's going on with the challenge and i'll be adding some more tomorrow if you guys want to partake you guys can partake this challenge with me but if you guys like this kind of content, please like, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you, guys. Enjoy the rest of your day. Bye.